Hi you guys, it's me Kimberly. I just wanted to do a quick little um, video to show you um, the cabinet that Scott brought down for me um, so that I could get that ugly corner redone. The girls are down here playing shoots and ladders. Um, we did a jelly print live stream today and the girls also did some watercolors that they've got hanging up there on the piano and these are the jelly prints that I did. They're overlapping um, because I had to lay them out a bit to dry but I did quite a few and I had a lovely time with all of the people that joined me. It was so much fun and I got so many great, great prints and I've got some more over here. So I'm gonna do another video um, adding some more layers onto some of these with some stamping and yeah, I was really super happy with the way that some of these, most of them, actually, mo most of them came out really, really well. So we had a really fun time. That's one of my favorites there. Um, this one here was really nice. Yeah, just some really, really great ones. Had some really, really great ones this time. Sean, Mr. Tellerian, he challenged me to do a flag, so I got quite a few prints off of my flag. But anyways, the reason why I wanted to turn the camera on is to show you my cabinet here. I am going to paint my little knobs gray because I don't like them being green. This is my mail bag. This is what I put all my outgoing mail in and take to the post office with me. So I just hung that up here on these knobs. Um, I do still have my recyclable boxes here. Um, so those are still here, but I can get to my dry erase board for school, which we're starting on Monday. And then I've got these stackable drawers here, which I put some of the kids' art supply stuff for school here. Um, all of our bags, or not bags, I don't know why I said bags. All of our <coughs> school books are stacked here. Our curriculum books <coughs> are here. All of our curriculum weeks are all set up here. My teaching manuals are here. So I got all of the school stuff ready. And a couple people have asked that I do a couple of homeschool videos. So I'll probably just include that on this channel. You know, every once and again, do um, a couple of videos of what our school days are like. Um, that will be fun for us. <coughs> Sorry, I cannot get over this cold. So this cabinet has three drawers. One, two, three. So let's start in this bottom drawer. So down here I just have like a canvas bag. These are just things to alter. I have an H and a B down here that I've been wanting to alter for the girls. Um, a canvas bag that I can alter. And then um, this is a bag that I got from a friend. I think I want to wait. That I'll probably fill back up when we do our next little exchange that I'll send stuff back to her in. Um, some extra Q-tips and cotton balls. A shelf that I'm going to alter. Um, some of my foam foam. That's all foam. I have some crepe paper here, some um, sandwich bags, and some styrofoam balls. And then in the second drawer, in here I've got bubble wrap and um, brown plastic bags. This is all of my recycled plastic stuff. All of the plastic off of ATCs that I've received. Um, packaging 
bags, just anything that I can put anything in. Down below here, I've got some more chipboard from food products, food boxes. And over here are mailing envelopes, and then I've got a bunch of bigger bags that I got from the Creative Reuse store. Third drawer, I've got these baskets. These are just some pretty envelopes and some stamped papers and stuff that people have sent me. These are all paint chips, paper clips. These are all paper clips and clothes pins. Just plumful. These are brads and um, charms. Just, you know, all those little kinds of yummy things. So that's drawer number three. And then this is the cabinets. Let me back up here so you can see. So that's what it looks like. I was able to put those three drawer plastic totes on either side, which worked out perfectly. And those, these right here are the um, shoe boxes, the plastic shoe boxes that I just got at the Dollar Tree. And um, I like the clear ones because I can see what's in them. And then up on the top shelf, um, this tote has my sewing stuff in it. And that is my new, where am I? I'm trying to point to things. My new die cutting, we are memory keepers, that die cutting machine that I just got. And my, um, what is that machine called? Um, laminator is over there. <clears throat> so in here I have all of my extra glue guns glue sticks and this tiny stapler that I haven't fastener thing that I haven't even used yet. I need to get that out and try it. I need to see if I can find some of these little staples somewhere. <clears throat> in this one, I I threw these in here, these things that I just got at Michael's because I didn't know where else to put them, so I just put them in there. But this is basically stuff to alter. I've got puzzle pieces in here. I've got um, some tickets in there, some brown class paper bags, these, and then I've got these colorful ones. I've got these flat canvases, <clears throat> these panel canvases, and playing cards, tickets, things to alter. Up here are more things to alter um, empty ribbon spools like this. This is an empty crayon box. These are the acorns I just got. Just, you know, odds and ends type stuff that I can use and alter. Down here is washi tape. More washi tape. These are all bag type things. Brown paper bags. Um, all bags. These are all just different bag type things. I have some popcorn bags in here and just all different bags. Doilies. Glitter. More glitter. And then down here are feathers and fibers. Feathers and fibers. These are all notebooks and notepads to alter. These are my medications. They're in there. And like I said, this is just all sewing stuff. Needles, threads, um, anything to do. My presser foot is in here. These are all patterns that I've gotten off the internet. Um, my quilting part is up here. Um, I have a couple patterns up here. Um, this is my paper bead rolling stuff. Um, this is the one embossing folder I have and the die cut that came with my little die cutting machine here. 
my die cutting machine and the plates. These are clipboards that I got to alter and these are those file folders that I just recently bought and an um, extra extension cord up here. So that is what the cabinet looks like. I love, we bought this this way off of Craigslist. Um, they painted the outside and it's got glitter in the paint. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's got actually got glitter. It's glittery. The inside is very glittery. And paint pink. It's painted pink with glitter. But I, like I said, I am going to paint these gray because I don't like that green. Mm -hmm. Goes well with my mail bag. But I'm going to paint them gray. And then up on top, um, back behind here, I have all of my um, chipboard pieces that I've cut out of food containers and whatnot that I use mostly for tags. Um, that pot of silk flowers. This is the tea jar right here that I altered. These are all receipts because I like to make the receipt altered flowers. My sewing machine. I have all of my homemade sprays and bot sprays back there. And that's it. I was able to keep my ribbons on my recycled um, DVD or CD CD stand. It's my ribbon stand now. And everything else is pretty much the same. This did get cleaned up a bit. I put these stackable things that I got at the Dollar Tree up here and it just has office supplies in it now. But I like them better over here. I straightened up my paper a bit. These are a friend's stickers that need to go to her. But yeah, I mean, this is a little bit neater. Not much. I mean, I've just, got, I've got a lot of stuff. So I did have to put my stickers up there in a bigger container. And um, yeah, so things... My doilies, that's what I have left of my doilies. I've probably given three quarters of my doilies away, and I'm good with the amount that I've got. Um, I'm keeping those what I got. I did hang my my um, cat hand. Um, cat hand did this ATC here, and then the ad admins on her page. Book Lady Jane and Cat Cat Kemper did the other one, but these are the admins on mixed media morsels because I won that drawing, and this is the frame that I altered to put those in, and I love it. It's so pretty. Um, I hung that art piece that I did for um, the creative art collaboration. Um, love autumn art. I hung that there. What else have I hung? I don't think I've hung anything else. I don't have a lot of wall space in this room. Well, I do, but as you can see, it's all taken up. That's my piece from, um, was that school art? School art one. And school art too. And that's it, you guys. So now they're playing Hi Ho Cheerio. And are you guys excited to start start school on Monday? Yeah, but I'm so excited for my helmet. Yep, yeah, we had to hi um, order Brooklyn a new helmet because her head's too big. So what are you excited about starting school? Are you excited to start second grade? Mm -hmm. Are you excited to be second graders? Mm -hmm. No, what is a second grader? You're in second grade. Where do you do school? Right in here. Where's your school table? Right Where are you going to sit? Uh, I sit right there next to my, on my pillow. Where I so this is this is Haley's chair, mm -hmm. and this is Brooklyn's chair. No. no, you have to sit here because you have to be able to see the whiteboard, right? 
and then grandma sits in one of those chairs, probably that chair. Oh, so are you excited to do school down here this year? Mm -hmm. Where did we do school last year? Up there in the loft. Mm -hmm. Did you like doing school in the loft? Yeah, uh, I like the sun. You like it down here more? Mm -hmm. Is it brighter down here? Yeah. But we liked doing school in the loft, didn't we? Mm -hmm. That was fun, too. This house only has one window, right? But it was still bright enough up there. You're going to like it down here more? And I don't even know why I want to put my shorts in now. Okay, we'll tell everybody, what do we say? Have a good... Say it loud so they can hear you. Have a good... I didn't understand it. Have a good... No, start with mm, morning, Good morning. Even. afternoon, afternoon. And, evening. and evening, wherever, and bye guys, bye. wave.